Dear students, next time we will a problem with the characteristic equation. Our question is, find the characteristic equation of 1, minus 1, 2, minus 2, 1, 3, 3, 2, minus 3. Okay. Solution. Let A equal to take the given matrix. Your given matrix is 1 minus 1, 2, minus 2, 1, 3, 3, 2, minus 3. Next, their formula the characteristic polynomial of capital A is formula the lambda cube minus s1 lambda square plus s2 lambda minus s3 equal to 0 idu check panikonu first ethana row ethana column paakonu how many rows and columns idu row paathina idu row 1 row 2 idu row 3 idu column 1 column 2 column 3 so the given matrix is a 3 cross 3 matrix 3 rows 3 columns if it is 3 rows 3 columns then you apply the formula lambda cube minus s1 lambda square plus s2 lambda minus s3 equal to 0 if it is 2 cross 2 matrix, then we can use other formula. Next, first we are going to find S1 value. So, S1 equal to sum of the main diagonal elements. So, sum of the main diagonal elements, right to a given matrix, 1, minus 1, 2, minus 2, 1, 3, 3, 2, minus 3, find the sum of the elements, this is your main diagonal, find the values, the values are 1 plus 1 minus 3, so S1 equal to, you add all the values, you get minus 1. This is S1 value. Next formula S2 equal to sum of the minors of the main diagonal elements. So next, we are going to find the minus of the main diagonal. So, in the rough work, I write uh, the same determinant for three times, given matrix for three times. It's a rough work. So 1 minus 1, 2, minus 2, 1, 3, 3, 2, minus 3, 1 minus 1, 2, minus 2, 1, 3, 3, 2, minus 3, 1, minus 1, 2, minus 2, 1, 3, 3, 2, minus 3. Now, we are going to find the minors. Minors here, diagonal elements. Main, your diagonal elements are this. This is the diagonal elements. Now, we are going to find the minors of the diagonals. Your first minor is here, 1. So, this minor is delete the entire row and column, you get the remaining element. So, your remaining element is 1, 3, 2, minus 3. Next, consider the second matrix here. In the diagonal, your second minor, minors of the diagonal. So, your another minors of the diagonal that is the element number 1. So, you delete the entire row and column. This row and column cancel, write the remaining elements. So, your remaining elements are see the element this is your remaining elements 1 2 3 minus 3 so 1 2 3 minus 3 next in the another matrix you find the diagonal elements here minus in the main diagonal element other is minus 3 so delete it this row and column so your remaining elements are 1 minus 1 minus 2 1 so 1 
minus 1 minus 2 1 now you cross multiple using another method now we found the minus of the main diagonal next you are going to simplify the matrix so you again apply the formula how do you simplify a b z d is here elements of the determinant then you simplify in this method this is equal to a d minus you cross multiple you get p c or c p this is your formula you apply the same formula here so 1 dot minus 3 is equal to you get 1 dot minus 3 minus again you cross multiple you get 2 dot 3 next plus again here you cross multiple you get 1 dot minus 3 middle minus sign this direction you multiple you get 3 dot 2 plus in the last determinant again you cross multiple you get 1 dot 1 middle sign minus again you cross multiple this direction minus 2 dot minus 1 that's your value now first simplify this matrix this, this value you get 1 dot minus 3 is minus 3 minus 2 dot 3 is 6 plus in the next bracket you simplify you get 1 dot minus 3 is minus 3 minus 2 dot 3 is 6 plus in the last value the bracket value you are going to simplify you get 1 dot 1 is 1 minus into minus into minus see that you have 3 minus other minus into minus into minus so you get minus only 2 dot 1 is 2 so next you are going to simplify all these things you get minus 9 next bracket is also minus 9 final value minus 1 so your answer is minus 19 your s2 is value is equal to minus 19 next we are going to find the value of s3 equal to your formula is determinant of a so you find the determinant value of a write the same matrix inside 1 minus 1 2 minus 2 1 3 3 2 minus 3 you have to find the determinant value of the matrix now first you give the sign see your first row value first term value is plus sign so second term value is minus sign the second uh, next term value is plus sign so the signs are always alternative next you are taking this is minus this is plus this is minus this is plus minus plus in this way we are giving the sign for the terms but we consider the first three rows value only that is enough for us so next we are going to solve the determinant here also you take the rough work 1 minus 1 2 minus 2 1 3 3 2 minus 3 3 times you take it 1 minus 1 2 minus 2 1 3 3 2 minus 3 again also 1 minus 1 2 minus 2 1 3 3 2 minus 3 you take it for 3 times now we are going to find the minus of the first row so your first row first term value you see you have plus sign outside see this is plus sign so your plus determinant if that value is also 1 see see the value this is equal to 1 so plus 1 half write the minus value next your value see that your next values are minus 1 it has sign also outside minus 1 so minus 1 half minus of minus 1 here you, you have the value already minus sign we assigned outside so minus of you have the number value that is also minus 1 so this is minus 1 to write the minus inside next final value your final value see it has plus sign it has plus sign and it has the value 2 so plus 2 into write the minus now we are going to find the minus of this term and apply see here you consider the number 1 delete the row and column these are the minus you apply inside here so your value is 1 3 2 minus 3 
Here second, our next minor is, consider this value minus 1, in the row and column you tell it. Remaining your values are minus 2, 3, 3 minus 3. So, minus 2, 3, 3 minus 3. Our final value here, find the minus of 2. So, you need to delete the row and column, values are these values. So, minus 2, 1, 3 and 2. Now, we are going to simplify this matrix. So, determinant, in the 2 cross 2 determinant, now we are using the method determinant of A, B, C, D equal to cross multiple A, D minus B, C. The same method we are applying. So, here outside 1 into, you simplify inside you get cross multiple 1 dot 3 is you directly multiple 1 dot 3, 1 dot minus 3 is minus 3. Next middle minus sign, next you multiple 2 cross 3, 2 cross 3 is 6. So, 6. Next here minus into minus, minus into minus you get plus sign. Again simplify inside that minus. So, minus 2 dot minus 3 you get plus 6. Next middle always minus sign. Next cross multiple here 3 dot 3, 3 dot 3 is 9. Next plus 2 into here you cross multiple minus 2 dot 2 is minus 4. Middle minus sign. Next you cross multiple 3 dot 1 is 3. Next you are going to simplify this you get minus 9, 1 into minus 9, here you solve that you get minus 3, 2 into minus 7. Now you are going to add all these terms. So 1 into minus 9 is minus 9, here plus into minus 3 is minus 3, plus 2 into minus 7 is minus 14. Now you are going to simplify all these terms, minus 14 plus minus 3 is minus 17, minus 17 plus minus 9 is minus 26. So, your S3 answer, S3 equal to 26. Next, write your formula, record formula is lambda cube minus S1 lambda square plus S2 lambda minus S3 equal to 0. So, lambda cube minus S1, what is your S1 value? S1 value is, check it, minus 1. So, your S1 value is minus 1 plus S2 lambda, check your S2 value, S2 value is minus 19 plus, sorry, minus S3, so minus S3, what is the S3 value, that is 26 equal to 0, so lambda cube, here you multiply multiple minus into minus you get plus 1. So, so plus 1 lambda square. Next to plus into minus you get minus 19 lambda minus 26 equal to 0. Here already minus of it's minus 26. You would all the times you get minus 26. Yes, 3 is minus 26. So, S3 here also you get minus 26. So, minus into minus you get plus 26 here. So, 26 equal to 0. So, your record equation, final equation is therefore, hence the characteristic polynomial is your record formula lambda cube plus lambda square minus 19 lambda plus 26 equal to 0. This is your final answer. Thank you.